At last, in university videos are now 100% free. If you remember a few months ago, I made a video talking about how Atlassian did something weird. They made it so that you couldn't sign up for new classes. And it was a little odd at the time, but now, now we know why they did this. And it's all because they've now made all their courses free. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the channel. Drop a like if you get value out of this video. And don't forget to check out the links down below because if you're interested in free resources, then I have a lot of resources for you in that link tree down below. So make sure you click on it because I have free and paid resources available for you. Let's jump into today's video and let's talk about Atlassian University. Okay, so if you've never been to university.atlassian.com, then you're really missing out on some really interesting things. In case you didn't know, Atlassian does have like their own learning portal. It's not my favorite. I still prefer my videos, of course. Maybe I have a little bias, but it is a great place if you're completely new to the world of Atlassian. It's a great place for you to go and learn and just kind of get your feet wet and learn and explore what Atlassian is all about. And most importantly, it's also the place where you go to get your certification. So if you want to become a certified expert or a certified professional in the world of Atlassian, the Atlassian University is the place to go and get started with that. But today we're not talking about certifications. We're going to be focusing on their completely new and free learning paths. So let's take a look. So here we are in the university.atlassian.com. Link is in the description down below. And as I mentioned at the beginning of the video here, all of these trainings are now free. They used to cost Hmm, maybe around pre COVID, they used to be like upwards of like closer to a hundred bucks. And it depended on each course right around COVID timeframe, right around 2020 and at 2020, maybe early 2021, they dropped the price down to $40, which is really affordable. But now as of May 1st, 2024, they have completely dropped down the price to zero. So it's big giant goose eggs. So what do you get with free training? Well, pretty much anything and everything that is available that was available before, except for the certification stuff. For that stuff, you still have to pay. But you can come in here now, and as you can see, right out of the gate, they're hitting you with focused learning, quick results, get started with free learning paths. And so you can come down here, explore the learning paths. This is where I would start with, and you click into this. And then you want to pick what are you interested in? Are we going to be doing your software, Confluence, JSM, work management, or Trello? These are the big products that they have. And we'll just click into your software. Once we get in there, you're going to see that they have about 2.8 hours worth of free trainings here just for your software. And it's a whole in-depth course. And again, you used to have to pay for this. It was like 40 bucks. And so now it's completely free. And if your team is struggling, if you guys are just like, I need better Jira training, or I want free Jira training because I don't have a training budget, then this is a great place to just put on your intranets inside and send your teams over to this website so that they can at least start getting familiar with the tools. Now I will say, and I'm not trying to throw shade here, but I will say that their trainings are a little dry. They're, they're very just like get you in. They're, they're gonna explain to you the basics and what happens and how to use it but they don't go into the whys kind of like my video. So if you are into learning, I still recommend you check out my live playlist linked down below as well, because those videos that I did a couple summers ago, they don't only just go into the basics of the, of how the tools work, but they also do go more into the why we do the things that we do, the decisions that we do within the world of Jira. Now, that's the free training. Highly recommend you check it out. Again, you have a lot of training, but I wanted to take a second here to get a little deeper with you. I wanted to go a little bit into what is a free training because statistically, I'm not very happy. I shouldn't say that. I don't think that this is the best idea. I, I get that at last is just trying to make all their content available for free. This is really, really good. I think from a from a marketing perspective, awesome. Like people can just get free training for free. Although there was always my YouTube channel, just saying. Um, but now the dynamic does change a little bit because when the training's free, when the training is this in depth, 2.8 hours, and you don't have to pay for it, psychologically, we have some differences that happen in our brains. And a lot of people don't usually commit to these free trainings because if it doesn't hurt you, if it doesn't cost you anything, 
then you take it very relaxed. And most of the time, you don't actually finish the courses. So I still prefer paid courses just because when you cough up some money, you kind of want to get your money's worth. But now when something's free, you kind of lost the value of why you're doing it. My opinion. And those are just my two cents. But let me know in the comment section, what do you think about free training? Do you prefer free training? Or do you, are you the type of person that you would prefer to pay? Maybe it's a little bit. Maybe it's 15 bucks, 50 bucks, $100. What's the limit, right? Where At what point do you say like, hey, I just paid $500 for a course. I'm going to take this $500 course. Or I'm going to pay attention to every second of this $500 course. Versus when the courses are free, are you chatting on the side? Are you multitasking? Are you paying as much attention? So I'm really curious. Let me know in the comment section. My belief is that while this is awesome, this is great that the training is free. I think that the behavioral uh, challenges that they're going to see is maybe something they weren't considering. I'm not sure. Again, I would rather pay for the courses, although I will say that when you do got to pay for a course, it kind of makes you really second guess whether you are going to actually take it because then you're like, am I actually going to be committed to it? Right. And so it's kind of an interesting area, this whole online course thing. So let me know in the comment section what you think. I just wanted to make you aware that these courses are not 100% free in case you weren't aware. I know at last I sent out an email to everybody, but in case you didn't know, all the Alaskan training is now free. So go check it out. Let me know what you think. I'm very interested in the comment section. Do you like it? How do those compare to my videos? Is there anything from these courses that I can take and improve my videos in? Let me know in that comment section down below. That's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe if you've made it this far. And if you want to check out my learning resources, I have free and paid learning resources. Make sure you check out that link in the description down below. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next one.